How's it going everyone? All of Pokemon TCG here. Back again with another pack opening. If you guys have watched our most recent mail time, you will have um, seen the blister packs from Target that I bought. It comes with three packs in each blister, and you can see all the various packs in front of you right now. I believe it's 30 packs. So we're going to be opening them all on this, uh, on this video. Um, there's anything from Phantom Forces to Boundaries Crossed to Platinum Arceus. Uh, it's going to be insane. This is going to be fun. Um, so we're going to get right into it. I have them organized from top to bottom. The top being the newest set and the bottom being the oldest set. Not perfect because we have like one Next Destinies and one Dragon's Exalted. Not really sure which one comes first. But it's the same era. So all the X and Y ones will be first. So we are going to start with a Phantom Forces pack. We only have one of these. So hopefully we can pull something cool from it. Um, I mean, obviously we want that Dialga secret rare, but I doubt that'll happen. So out of 30, a booster box comes with... Um, how many? 36. So, I mean, we should get like four, three or four. So we start off with a first Seeker. Laldred, Handscope, Krabby, Totodile, Alamomola, Wismer, Swirlix, our reverse is a Wismer, and our rare is a Heliolisk Hollow. So we start off with a Hollow, not bad, not bad. Pretty cool Hollow there in Heliolisk. So we have two Flash Fire packs, our first one being a Pyroar. Not sure how long this video is going to go, but um, I think you guys will like it. Tons of different sets, so it's not like all, we aren't going to see pretty much any doubles of any cards, um, unless we get unlucky, <laughs> but um, I think we have a lot of boundaries crossed, you can see all the weight here, so we'll probably get some some doubles in those, but it shouldn't be too much. Start, start us off in this flash fire pack with a love disc, a protection cube, an avalug, a ponyta, binnacle, buizel, spritzy, c-dot, a reverse rose raid that is just an uncommon, and a regular rare durant. So, I'm hoping to kind of hold off on pulling Ultra Rares in the X and Y sets. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to complain if we get one. But I meant, like, if we're going to pull them, I'd rather pull them in the Black and White sets or the Platinum Arceus or Supreme Victors pack we have. But, um, cause I, just because I don't have... There's more of more Ultra Rares in those sets than that I don't have than the newer sets. I believe the only one I'm missing in Flashfire is like the Secret Rare Mega Kangaskhan. So if we pull that, then we're in good shape. Nuzleaf, Sentret, Duskull, Rosalia, Gumi, Flabebe, another... Really? I said we'd get no um, doubles and we pulled two Reverse Roserades. And at least our rare is not the same. A regular rare low punny. So two Reverse Roserades back to back. What the heck are the chances? So hopefully um, we can pull something good out of these X and Y base set packs. I believe we have eight. That's a lot of X and Y base set. Seemed like almost every one of the blisters. I think every one of the blisters had an X and Y pack in them. And then two black and white packs. Or even um, the one had actually two different blisters. One had... Oh no, they were in the same one. The Platinum Arceus and Supreme Victors were in the same pack, and then they had like an X and Y base set. So a Jigglypuff Reverse, and a Malamar Regular Rare. So hopefully we can at least pull another Hollow here soon. I don't like seeing all these regular rares. And you know what? You guys can have this code right here. Let me know what you guys get down in the comment section, or hit me up on Twitter. Show me a picture of what you guys got. I saw someone in the one of the last episodes... Got a Kirami X, I believe, from Ancient Origins. So it's pretty cool. Dark energy there. A Weedle, a Zorba, Venipede, Skitty, a Reverse, Ponyard, and our rare is a Crocodile. So I don't know um, how much luck we're going to have with these blisters. I mean, I've opened them before, but unlike a booster box, you aren't really guaranteed anything. So... 
I mean, we could go through all these and not pull anything, which would really suck, to be honest. But it's still cool to open all these different sets. So we have Froggy Deer, but they are officially licensed by Pokemon. So it's not like someone's gone through, weighed them, put them back for sale or anything. Plus they're sold at Target, so that doesn't happen. A Reverse Pikachu looks kind of cool. And a Hollow Rhyperior, nice. So there's another Hollow. Pretty cool card there. So we it looks like we have four more X and Y base set packs, including this one. And then we get into the good stuff. I think the one of the only I think Noble Victories and Legendary Treasures were like the two packs that we don't have any of in the black and white. I think we at least have one of everything else. Shelter, every that is a rare of reverse rare Stoutland, awesome, and a cloister regular rare. So hopefully we pull an ultra rare soon. To get a little hype going. It is kinda late where I am recording right now. So I'm kind of tired, but we're fighting through. Definitely excited to open these packs. We're just getting started. Diggersby, Ladian, Mr. Mime, Chespin, NK, Phantom, Bunnelby, Pumpkaboo, a Reverse Rhydon, that is a rare, and a regular rare Swallow. I actually don't even know if I have that Swallow. Looks pretty cool. I don't remember seeing that before. Alright, give me an Ultra Rare. Give me an ultra rare. Please? Maybe if I ask nicely. Please? So we get a Whirlipede. We've gotten two reverse rares and two hollows, I believe, so far. So I guess that's not too, too bad, but it could be better. Lilypup, Inke, a reverse Sandile, and another Malamar. Huh. So we did get doubles of a rare, but it's in one of the packs that we have like eight of. I believe Boundaries Crossed and X and Y Base Set were the ones we had the most of. Alright, so this is our last X and Y Base Set. See, like, the next one, I don't know if Plasma Freeze or Plasma Blast comes first. Oh, and we do, we do not have any Plasma Storm. That is another one that was not in any of the blister packs. Which kind of sucks, because that's the one the Secret Red Charizard is in. So we get a Fennekin, Grass Energy... Another reverse rare being a Tauros. Are you kidding me right now? You're kidding me, right? A third Malamar? That is weird. That is weird, guys. We go through whole booster boxes without getting a double of, or without getting three of the same rare. We've done it plenty of times before. I don't know. That's, that's pretty weird. Alright, but we got our Plasma Blast booster pack here. We got a Glalie, Duosion, Porygon 2, Teddy Ursa, Porygon, Larvesta, Bagon, Machop. Is that a rare? Another reverse rare being a Golurk. We've gotten, we're like in reverse rare heaven right now. And a Driftblim regular rare. So I'm not, I can't be too mad. I mean, reverse rares aren't really that common, hence the rare part. But, um, we could definitely go for an ultra rare right now. Hopefully we pull one soon. <sighs> Alright, so we got a reversal trigger, war turtle, machoke, snorunt, bagon, squirtle, teddy ursa, machop. Whoa, that's pretty cool looking. A reverse glalie, and a sigilyph hollow. I love these hollows. Some people hate them, but I love them. With the lines going across. Alright, Plasma Freeze. So we got four Plasma Freeze packs. We really, we're like in desperate need of an Ultra Rare right here. Please. How many packs we open? I don't know, we've opened way more than eight, which is the average. There we go. Flareon, Lantern, Krakorok, Grimer, Nidoran, Temple, Dano, Vanillite, a reverse, that is another reverse rare, Chandelure, and a Staraptor regular rare. So another, how many reverse rares is that? We'll have to go through and count them at the end. That's insane. I haven't pulled an ultra rare yet though. Kind of a bummer. I wouldn't even be mad if we go through all these and end up pulling an ultra rare in like Supreme Victors or Arceus, or Platinum Arceus though. That'd be really cool. So we got Miltank, Nidoran, Weedle, 
Grimer, Yamask, Litwick, a Reverse Nidoran, and a Hollow Reshiram. Look at that card. With Purifying Flame and Fusion Flare. Pretty awesome Hollow right there. So we got two more Plasma Freeze packs. We have opened up a lot of Plasma Freeze on the channel before, actually. Um, I believe we've opened two booster boxes. One being by itself a booster box opening and the other being in our uh, 100 subscriber special, I think it was. Yamask, Weedle, Temple. That's another rare. What is going on right now? Another, we should be doing a pack battle with these. We'd be like at 100 points or something. But we got a reverse rare Cofagrigus and a regular rare Leafeon. So my battery's actually getting low. I'm going to have to pause it and grab my charger real quick. Alright guys. So we got one more Plasma Freeze pack here. Should be all good to go with the charger and everything. Can we pull an Ultra Rare for... Finally. <laughs> Can we finally pull an Ultra Rare? <sighs> Alright. Start us off with a Shadow Triad. Palpitoad. Lampent. Nidoran. Primeape. Horsey. Dano, Litwick, a Reverse Nidoqueen, that is another rare. I don't know what's going on. And a Mr. Mime. We can't pull an Ultra Rare, but we can pull like 20 Reverse Rares. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 Boundaries Crossed Packs. Hopefully, hopefully we can pull something. I'll be doing um, probably another TCGO opening, like the online thing with all these different packs and everything, and think that'd be kind of cool. Heracross, Darmanitan, War Turtle, Energy Search, Scyther, Potion, Oshawott, Gliger, another Reverse Rare, Keldeo, and a Hollow Crustle. I don't have this card. Huh. That's pretty awesome looking. It's kind of plain, but it's cool at the same time. But we... Can we just, like, step back a second? Does, like, every one of these packs have a reverse rare in it? But none have an ultra rare? <laughs> is, that what, is that what's going on here? Um, I, I, don't, I don't know what's going on, guys. So, three to the front. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. <sighs> we desperately need something. Focus. Can you focus, please? There we go. Azumarill. Watchog. Dewat. Spoink. Pikachu, Switch, Tepig, Charmander, guys, look, that's a star, focus, that is a star, that is another reverse rare, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, what the heck, a Celebi EX Full Art, we finally pull an ultra rare, and it is a doozy. Look at this card right now. Oh my gosh. I gotta sleeve this right away. That is a really good card. That makes up for it. That pool. A full art Celebi. Oh my word. We <laughs> oh man. We'll have to do a, a recap at the end for all these reverse rares too. This is getting like out of hand. Alright, so after that amazing pool, you know, I'd be just fine with only getting that. That card is so awesome. And I don't, it's one I don't have yet. So it's another one I get to cross off my list. Pat Rat, Woobat, Snivy. Guys, these things have to be guaranteed. A reverse rare Golduck. That is a rare. And a regular rare Blossom. I, I'm, you guys are going to have to let me know in the comment section what's going on. I've never pulled this many reverse rares, like ever, in my entire life. Ne never this many in a row. How many in a row has it been? So there's a Skyla. They're redoing that card, but in a full art version soon. Swana, Aspersia City Gym, Pat Rat, Venipede, Switch, Snivy, Taylo, Heracross. Okay, finally, a card that is not a rare. And a Hollow Ditto. It, I mean, it's um like reminiscent, but... To, oh crap, what set was that? Was it like Fossil or something? Or was it base set? Kind of like that ditto that they had in that set that only had Transform. I mean, that's all ditto gets anyway. But I, I'm pretty sure that's like what they're shooting for there. 
So we got three more boundaries crossed packs. I like these boundary boundaries crossed packs. They're a pretty cool set. I'm excited to open up the codes online. Maybe they'll have something better. I mean, of course, Fool Art Celebi is amazing. Pig Knight, Great Ball, Town Map, Chin Chow, Energy Search, Electabuzz, Dwebble, Purloin, another reverse rare, this being a Jelly Scent, and a regular rare Jelly Scent. So we get another reverse rare. I can't even, like, be excited anymore. That's got to be at least 12. At least 12. All right. Watch us pull another reverse rare. I'm calling it right now. Another reverse rare. Great Ball. Mandibuzz. War Turtle. Dwebble. Spoink. Meryl. Potion. Togepi. Oh, it's not. It's just a Dwebble. The one time I call it, we don't get it. And a Hollow Electrovire. I don't have a lot of these Hollows. I haven't opened up um, much Boundaries Cross before, so it's kind of cool. I really like that. Pretty awesome Hollow. Let me know um, what your guys' favorite card is. I mean, mine, obviously, so far is the Celebi. But you guys might not like Celebi, and maybe you like something else better. Hopefully, we can pull one more Ultra Rare before the end of this video. Start off with a Snorlax, Town Map, Charmeleon, Spinda, Rattata, Makuhita, Psyduck. We haven't seen most of these before. Dunsparce, Reverse Lillipup, and a regular Rare Musharna. So two packs in a row with no reverse rares. Even though we went like 12 in a row getting them. <laughs> oh, Alright. So now we are on to Next Destinies. So this, this set has a really expensive card being the Mewtwo Full Art. That's like a $45 card. Vanillish, Cricketot, Muna. Not sure how much the Celebi goes for, but I would imagine it's not too cheap. Ralts, a reverse Muna. And a regular rare Arcanine. If I had to guess, I'd probably say pretty close to 20. Maybe like 17 or 18. That could be wrong. Maybe it is cheaper. I'm not. I'm just overdoing it or something. I don't know. But this is Dragon's Exalted. We have opened a box of these before on the channel. Focus. I think it's focused. Whalmer. Stunfisk. Skun, Skun Tank. Right after Stunfisk. Dano. Temple. Gibble. Magikarp. Electric, another reverse rare, being a Probopass, and a regular rare Driftblim. Drift so now we have two emerging powers. The only... Well, this one's, like, open. Huh. I didn't do that. Well, good thing the code card is in the back. Didn't ruin the back card. I mean, it's just an uncommon anyway, but that's really weird. You can see how the code card got really ruined. Not that we need it, obviously, but good thing that was back there. Um, the only one, the only ultra rares you can get in this are two full arts, being Tornadus and Thunderous. Is that right? I'm pretty sure that's right. Or, I don't think Landorus is in it. I think it's just them two. Another reverse rare. And a Hollow Cobalion. So we got a reverse bear Levani and a hollow Cabalion. We've gotten a lot of hollows actually. I'm liking it. I don't have. A, I don't think I've had most of these hollows. So our last emerging powers pack. This one is not open from the side like the last one. Hopefully it opens for us. There we go. So hopefully we can pull um, one of those fool arts. That'd be pretty awesome. I, I'm pretty sure when we opened our uh, Victini tins that we got like the cobalion there uh maybe it's a cobalion i can't remember it's a full art of someone hopefully we can pull it right here oh my gosh we do what the heck well i wasn't actually expecting them to do it <laughs> we pulled a full art thunderous i think i have a few of these but it's still really cool to actually pull one i don't know if i've pulled any that's pretty awesome it is a white star, so definitely an ultra rare. So hook it back there with Celebi. And we have one black and white base set pack. Oh, that didn't open good. Hopefully, I'm pretty sure there's Reshiram and Zekrom in this one. And I can't even open it. Oh, come on. Just open. Ugh. 
Um, I have the Zekrom, but mine's like really, really beat up. And there's no code cards in this one. This was the only black and white set where there is no code cards. Pokemon Communication, Pokedex, Simisage, Zorua, Oshawott, Tepig, Blitzel, a Dark Energy. It has another reverse rare. <laughs> uh, you guys are going to have to let me know. Have you guys bought these blisters before and then you get a tons of reverse rares? Because we're going to go back through and count an a live bird. But now, for the cream of the crop, Platinum Supreme Victors and Platinum Arceus. We're going to open up Supreme Victors before, since we have opened a box of these on the channel. But um, I, I'm more excited about the Arceus one. I do have a lot of the Arceus uh, cards. Uh, I think it's three. I'm pretty sure it's still three. Yeah. Cynthia's Guidance. I'll go a little slower since we haven't seen these in a long time. Manectric, Ninjask, these are back when they had levels. Shinx, Bulbasaur, Combi, Meowth, cool looking Rhyhorn, a reverse Meowth, and a regular rare Claydol. So no luck there. Can we get some last pack luck? Arceus is on the front. Can he grant us some last pack luck? I don't know guys. We haven't gotten it in a while. A few episodes, I should say. There was a little bit there that we got it like every video, which was awesome. But um, I don't know. I would consider a hollow out of this last pack luck, at least in some kind of deg degree, because I don't think I have any hollows other than like um, the actual Arceus hollows that are like a subset. So it'd be cool, cool to pull one of them. Pikachu, Ghastly. Trash Cloak Burmy. The art is just so awesome on these cards. A Reverse Beginning Door. Interesting. And a, just a regular Rare Manectric. So no last pack luck, but that's okay. So we'll look at our two Ultra Rare pools here. We got a Full Art Thunderous, and the, the best one in my opinion, the Full Art Celebi. Such an awesome card. And we're going to go back through here. I'm going to pull out all the Reverse Rares. And we're going to count how many we got. So out of 30 packs... I think, I bet you we at least got 15. We had to have at least gotten 15. I don't want to pass any. No, nope, that's not a rare. That's a rare. That's a rare. One, there's two more. And that one. So I just realized something. You see like the reverses have the symbols on it, on the right, on the Codio. And then they went back to like the plain one for a plasma freeze. That's interesting. That one's not, that one is. That one's not, that one is. That one is. That one is. That one is. I don't know if we had to have any more. I think that was our first one there. Yep. So, pretty darn close to 15. If not over 15. 15's my guess. But, I don't know. I don't, I don't think it's going to be quite 15. All right, so we got Stalin, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Oh, so close. But still, 14 out of 30 packs had a reverse rare in it. That is, like, unheard of. At least, I think it's unheard of. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section about that. If they purposely implemented that into these booster or blister packs, I have no idea. But we didn't have, like, crazy luck other than the reverse rares. I mean, I guess we can go through and count the hollows, too. It can't hurt. We're doing, like, a little recap here anyway. So we got Cabalion, Electrovire, Ditto, Crustle, Reshiram, make sure I don't miss any, Sigilyph. So we got a lot of hollows. And Rhyperior, and I believe Heliolisk is our other hollow. So, I mean, we got a lot of hollows, actually, too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight hollows out of 30 packs. Ain't bad. So overall, 10 packs out of the 30 contain something more than just the regular rare. So that's pretty good, I guess. One third. I don't really know what the average ratio is when you divide it up like that. 
But um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Definitely going to be looking out for these boost blister packs again. I think you guys will like this kind of stuff. They're a little more random than just a whole booster box of the same thing. But we got tons more openings coming to the channel. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. And I'll see you guys next time.